sharing with you guys about breaking cycles and we talked about um, breaking cycles and what it is to identify the cycles and what we need to do so I just want to share with you guys for a few minutes as I was meditating on something and I shared in one of my blogs earlier but when we break when we're trying to break cycles in our life it's certain things that we have to do I was reading this scripture, I've read it before, and I've quoted it, and it tells us in tw uh, Romans 12 and 1 to lay away every weight, everything that's going to weigh us down and slow us down from running our race. So when we're talking about breaking cycles, we have to be willing, willing to let go of some things, let go of some people, let go of some imaginations, let go of some thoughts that hold us down. Because what happens is when you're trying to break a cycle, if you don't let go of something, if you can imagine a chain or imagine a wheel to interrupt it, something has to be broken. Then it causes it not to be a cycle. A cycle is a circle. A cycle is a pattern. So to break that pattern, something has to be broken in it so that it will change. So when we talk about breaking cycles, we have to understand that this. We have to be willing to identify it, what it is, understand, okay, what's the pattern, what it is, and then ask ourselves, hey, am I willing and ready to let it go? Because sometimes we talk about it, but we're not ready to let go of the issues or do enough or sacrifice enough to change it. We just want to complain about it and talk about it. So I'm sharing this with you today. We have to not only identify the cycles, the patterns, we have to be willing to let go of the things that connect us to those patterns, to those cycles in our life. Because if we're not willing to let go of them, you're never going to change them. You'll be going and uh, throughout the rest of your life talking and sharing. I say, I say this, that we, we, uh, we, it's like a broken record. We keep repeating the same thing over and over again. So when you're ready to change, really ready to change, not just talk about change, you have to be ready to break the cycles and lay down, get rid of those things that have weighing you down, that's causing the cycle to be a cycle. You got to be willing to let it go. Are you willing to let those things go in your life that are weighing you down, that are slowing you down because they prevent you from completing the course, completing your intended purpose in life? So you can have a purpose because remember, you guys, there's a, you know, I, I, I love God. So I, I, I speak from a biblical standpoint. There's God perfect will for your life. And then there's God permissive will. And it's too many of us that live out of God's permissive will because we're not willing to break cycles. We're not willing to change our lifestyle. We're not willing to sacrifice whatever it is and go through the process to change for the better. You've been listening to Tara T. Stallings. Hey, check me out on my webpage.